Well, hello everybody. Welcome to another ride along with goggles. And uh, boy, are we ever in a pickle here? <laughs> I've got the White Western Star here, and the great big cab, the uh, Legacy, this Legacy Sleeper. That it's one long chassis. And since I parked and got the load, I come back out and look what's happened here. We've got a Rocky Mountain Double beside us, so we're gonna have to figure out how to get out of here. Is that going to be straightforward? Okay, well, let's see what we can do here. I think we're going to have to... may take a little bit of maneuvering. How is any point in even trying that turn right now? This way a bit. Let's try and see if I can't uh, just keep moving the back of the trailer over. Has one long truck. Wow. Not doing too good on getting the trailer anywhere because the truck is so bloody long. Okay, well, let's see what we can do. Yeah, there's no way we're going to just pull it out of here. Try to get ourselves a little moving room here. Oh, maybe. Nope. Oh, I don't know. Yep. Wow, we did it. Okay. And the gate's right here. I have no, which, no idea which way we're going because the GPS isn't working. I think we're going to have to do a little maneuver to be able to get out of the yard, too. I'll have to look at the uh, world map to see where we're going because Lori seems to be quiet at the moment. Okay, let's just have a quick look at the world map. What are we doing out of here? Left? No? So, yeah, left, left, right. Okay. Well, it's a good thing it's left instead of right out of here. That would have been ugly. something else. Oh, I don't have my, my frame counter isn't working. I don't know why that is. Huh. Oh well. So I was configuring the oh let's get going. I was configuring this truck and I put so this profile I've got it in it's kind of a catch all profile. I got a whole bunch of stuff in. And um, it's a big one, like 180 some mods. And I have the uh, MTG 281 slash 351 peed in here. Keep right. After 50 yards, turn right. And I tried the wheels on it from that, that truck. And oh, turn right. I don't know what I've done, but I've locked further development on the truck. None of the uh, none of the buttons or you know the little icons you press on, click on, none of them work anymore. So I kind of froze the mod. So just going with what we got. Talk to us, Lori. Got no GPS Keep either. Right. Gallop in Santa Rosa. Oh. 
Boy, I bet you we want the Santa Rosa one. Mm. We're going to Clovis. Keep left. Yeah. Santa Rosa is that happy little place with that great big sharp bend in the highway as you get to it heading south. So I have to look for a sign. My little uh, tablet down here went to sleep. Let's see if we can wake it up. No, well, that didn't work. Boy, we're really out of touch. This other screen here. Speed limit 65. Okay, there we go. Oh. So yeah, this is one uh, awful long truck. So this is, as you know, the White Western Star from uh, Mason's Mod Shop, or if you didn't know, that's what it is. And um, it's still a work in progress. I was just communicating with them prior to uh, starting this video. I've been working on this skin for a few hours now. And um, they've got, they're working on more changes and they uh, gave me a little preview. And man, beautiful interior coming and uh, nice radio and uh, CB combination for up on the roof and let's see what else um, they're going to enable advanced trailer couple coupling and uh, yeah they're just working away at it definitely uh, getting somewhere making good changes Oh, speed limit's gone up. Handy if I could stay in my lane. Yeah, not sure why I couldn't get a GPS, but it may have something to do with putting something on this truck that locked up the uh, ability to configure it. I'm sure I had a GPS in the, uh, the Mercury cab version I did a video with, or a couple videos. So it's something I've done. Boy, as long as the trailer. Uh-oh. Wandering around. Get back on the road here. So I'm going faster than that guy. Don't say turn right. It's maddening when these guys do this. 75 mile an hour road and they get down to 64. Ugh. I wonder if we can get over here. Okay, 
here, so it could be, is this that right corner? Santa Rosa? Yeah, I think it is. No, maybe not. That was a bit sharpish, but not the one. Maybe it is. Yeah, it's got to be Santa Rosa here. Keep right after 50 yards. Exit right ahead. Exit right ahead. After 100 yards, turn right. Turn right. After 50 yards, keep right. So it would be handy to be able to just hit the map button and get the overlay like you get in a uh, uh, convoy. You get that while you're driving, that would be handy. So I don't know what's with the splash screen. I've been getting, uh, it says real advertising, you know, or real name places or whatever. And uh, is that, is that uh, splash screen advertising a mod? I went in and took all my, uh, I had three different uh, place name type mods. One was um, gas stations and real, real companies. And real advertising, so like the billboards on the side of the road. And what ended up uh, happening is I took them all out and I looked at the map and it's all Walbert and rail export. It seems to have changed every, it must have been a mod. So I know you can they advertise map mods on the splash screen, but I was pretty surprised by that. So I don't see that as the uh, splash screen. Weird. We might have a right turn up Keep here. Left. Nope. After 50 yards, turn left. Left turn. Well, it's better than a right turn. Turn left. A little bit more room here for it. Oh, the trailer is uh, Bart's Great Dane. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The Kid Museum. If you're new to the game, that's a Discovery Point. One of the things they want you to discover in uh, New Mexico. Clovis, that's where we're going. Yeah, I was mentioning the advertising thing because uh, I had some rail yard picked as my destination. And I was thinking it'd be nice to get in a rail yard, might have enough room to maneuver this thing. But uh, it's, uh, it's a rail export. And I took the advertising off. So, that's going to be ticklish. We'll see what they have. This uh, long a chassis may be something pretty crazy. I can turn this little tab. 
off and off and on. Kickstart it back to life. Doesn't look like it. Job's in a hurry. Should actually get on with it here a bit. Oh boy. Yeah, my PC dramas are, I would say they're over, but I got that faulty drive out of the PC and I was able to work on uh, some skins today and yesterday and uh, Man, I got a lot of catching up to do, but I still don't have everything I want off of that drive. So I got to reinstall it soon and keep trying to get stuff out off it. So, bit of a bummer. Oh, I know which kind of real export this is. This is the one with the big gantry crane, Clovis. Oh man, trying real hard not to sneeze. Whew. Might have done it. That's one long cap. See all the way back in there. It's like a motor home. Keep right. After 50 yards, turn right. You can do a little bowling in there. Turn right. Okay, this is about to get interesting. Might have to just... Yeah, there he goes. Nice. That's good. quite finished. Uh, I have to do the uh, Mercury Sleeper After version yards, for this skin left. as well. And uh, man, I'm taking a break from skinning today after this video. Turn left. I'm uh, get myself sorted out. Relax, do some Sunday night stuff. over there, container yard. After 100 yards, turn left. Turn left. side of this corner as much as we can. Kind of like coming in here with a uh, triple low boy. <laughs> Done that a lot. You have reached your destination. To this yard. Uh, let's see. All right. Yeah, I was coming in here a lot back then before I was making videos, but I started making the videos and I can't just keep doing the same thing all the time or I'd I'd just be dragging around low boys all the time. Uh, 
this could be interesting. Oh, jeez, they got right on the other side of a trailer. Well, let's see what we can do. So we got this room out here. This is nice. Okay. Look at how much it just continues to park over there. Pretty wild. Good mirrors on this track though. Probably gonna take half an hour for the front end to get over. Yeah. Crazy. That oh, will do her. There we go. Thirty two gallons. Well, <laughs> you know, it's, this is driving me nuts. I didn't do anything. I didn't change it back to to Imperial or um, standard from metric this time, but it's changed. Interesting. You boy. Who knows why it uh, jumps around like it does. Anyway, yeah. So work in progress. Well, this skin's pretty much done. I think uh, I don't have much more to do to this. Um, but uh, I do need to do the uh, Mercury Sleeper version, which is really short. So not too much of this is going to, well, the, the everything from the cab backward or the, sl the whole sleeper changes. And uh, we'll have to see what we can do. Anyway, thanks for following along, guys. Oh, look how crooked we were. Yikes. That's embarrassing. I shouldn't have showed you that. <laughs> anyway, take care. We'll catch you on the next one. And bye for now.